airport job. We're pounding in about uh, 4,500 feet of 10 foot high fence. So we're pounding these posts, they're 15 feet long, 15 feet in the ground, and uh, the setup behind me is what we're using. What we actually are using is an old Kiwi pounder we retrofitted to hold a rhino. Uh, we got a PD-140 on top of that Kiwi pounder. We use the actual Kiwi pounder to actually lift that, set it on the post, and help drive it in. So the boom actually gets lowered as you're pounding it in to get it down to your five foot mark. We uh, typically put all our corner posts in first so we can run our bottom tension wire and that's what we're using as our, our, our line mark. We mark that every 10 foot on the, on the grass so they know where to put the next post. We don't throw any of our posts out. We're actually carrying our post behind us on the trailer which is also holding the air compressor. The and then as he's pounding the post down we got one guy running the, the, the Kiwi Pounder and the uh, air compressor where the, and the other guy is leveling it. Then the third person is actually on the tractor, staying on the tractor, just moving the tractor forward as we get to the next pole. It's, it's set up so that the tractor actually has two pounders on it. We got the Kiwi Pounder in the back with the Rhino. And we also have another Rhino that's in the front, and that one there has a sleeve on it designed for a three inch post where we're doing only in the corners you got three posts to pound in versus uh, the line post is set up for two and a half inch and that's set up on the Kiwi Pounder. It makes it a lot quicker, we don't have to trade, we don't have to unhook and rehook up or switch out sleeves for going from one post to the other post. We're pounding these posts in anywhere from one minute or one and a half minutes to two minutes a post. So give or take, you know, depending on any problems and hitting ruts or things like that. At this airport, we actually moved the fence line in 10 feet in, the, in the, uh, numerous spots because of the problems with the existing fence. In other areas, what we've had to do was put temporary fence up before we can actually take down the existing fence and pound in a new fence. And then on this airport, again, there's some areas that we're actually extending the fence to 10 foot tall from 8 foot. So there actually is no security breach there. We're just going to be taking, adding two feet to the top. Uh, this job right now is uh, has just started. So we just started a few days ago. We've already pounded in 1,500 feet uh, yesterday. We're trying to get another 1,500 feet pounded in today. Um, shouldn't have no problems doing that. Provided that the snow don't come too early, we should have no problem getting this job done.